Okay, so what I'm doing is I'm going through and anything that's like expiring here like this month I'm putting over here to take upstairs because like we have just like a handful there's only room for like a handful of things upstairs so the bulk of everything stays down here and then every so often I just come down excuse me or we get low on something upstairs but like I'm just anything that's coming cl up close on date I'm just gonna take upstairs so like these have a while so we've got some ranch uh, Rice cakes, some white cheddar Cheetos puffs, some regular Cheetos puffs. I threw away some pretzel things I bought to do a video a long time ago. They're bacon habanero. Um, they expired like five months ago, so I got rid of those. And then some other, those were Dollar Tree snacks that I threw away. Um, <coughs> here's some more puffs. What's the date of these? May. So we'll come up on those too. But. I just got a thing of puffs. Um, I don't need to tell you what I'm doing, but that's what I'm doing. This is usually cracker type stuff. This is usually cookie stuff. And then this is chips. This is normally the kids' chips and then mine, like certain things that I get for myself that they don't eat. But we're just going to do whatever. Because then there's more chips. Nutty Bar, this is like the adult bag candy. It's not keto candy. And like the kids have their own candy bin. So this is my candy bin. Um... And yeah, there's popcorn chips. That's what I'm saying. Everything's just a big old mess. These get filled with the little bags of Doritos and orange chips. So that's what we're working on. The bottom's always drinks. So that's just what I'm doing.
before. This I did because I knew what I was going to wear. So I was very
have for now because I need to go take them up and feed them some lunch and then they need a nap. So we got extra chips and stuff, extra chips, single serve chips, that's like cookies. Um, these, I keep some upstairs, but I don't want them out in the front where the little ones can get them. I'll leave them back there where Adrian knows where they're at. But I always keep some upstairs on the rack that's on the basement door up there. So we've got crackers type things. Like I said, that's extra cookies. We always have a big bin of the orange chips from Sam's. It's like the pretzels and cheese and breadsticks and cheese. So we got Adri takes these little snack packs to school because they get to have a snack at school. So I just go get that variety pack. So this has Cheez Its and different cookies. We've got some graham, honey grams. Jackson, can you please stop knocking everything down the steps? Don't sit on them. You're going to smash the cupcakes. Leave them. This is a broken drawer that I got for shoes. I mean, it came broken from the, sorry, from the container store. So if you saw, I taped the back corner, so hopefully it'll slide it out. And it has a bunch of like single Oreos, or, like two packs of Oreos, these cookie things. Then with the Doritos, and I'll have to work on the rest later. I see, got Slim Jims, some backup Nutty Bars. This is all the popcorn stuff. And yeah, I showed you the rest. And then this will go upstairs. We have some banana chips, which I got these from Dollar Tree to see if anybody would like them. So these might go in the trash if nobody likes them. We've got some buttered puff corn, some cheese puffs, some ranch Doritos, and I got these honey roasted sesame chips I need to try because they're getting close to expiration date. And then so with these Christmas cupcakes I got to eat oiled Christmas crafts and that never happened. So yeah. Yeah. Hold on, buddy. I don't like him going up and down these because they're cement. Like if he, it's poured concrete. So if he, um, the whole house is. I say this all the time, but it really is. Like, it's cement. So if he falls, he's really going to bang himself up. Sit down, please. Okay? Hold, hold on a minute, okay? Okay, so I've got all the drinks, like, laid out here. So we have one Juicy Juice Fruit Punch. We have six of the... Um, Old Orchard Healthy Balance Strawberry Watermelon. That's their favorite. That's from Dollar Tree. So when I find it, I stock up. Like if Jay happens to go in his town, he'll stock up. Um, because you hardly ever find it. That right there is another Healthy Balance Peach Mango. Or another Old Orchard Healthy Balance from um, a diet juice from Dollar Tree. That's Peach Mango. Okay, so regular fruit punch from Juicy Juice. 29 carbs, 27 sugars this in one little eight ounce serving the old urge old orchard two carbs one gram of sugar hawaiian punch an eight ounce serving 11 carbs 11 sugars so it's like <laughs> if i can find the diet juice and i still mix that with water regular juice i put like this much in their cups and fill the rest with water um, the diet juice, I do like half of their cup with juice and the other half with water. So I even dilute the strawberry watermelon. Like that's the lowest sugar I can find. And then over here, let's see. And then we have, yeah, Hawaiian Punch, a Pedialyte for if anybody gets sick, um, a ginger ale in case anybody's having belly issues. And then we have their second favorite of the diet juices is the white grape strawberry. It has three carbs and two sugars. So like the strawberry watermelon is the best. Two carbs, one sugar. The peach mango is three carbs, one sugar. And then here's just juicy juice, strawberry watermelon, which I can't find very often either. So if I find that, I grab a few, a handful of those. I have four of those for when I can't find the diet one. Um, but yeah, that's, and I have four jugs of water down here because I mix, like I said, I mix all of their juices with water. So I need to try and get as many of these juices on here as I can fit. I'm going to have them use this one up next because they've been doing a lot of the strawberry watermelon, a lot of the white grape strawberry. So we'll switch it up and go to fruit punch next. And then probably a strawberry watermelon and then a peach mango just to change it up all the time. But yeah, that's our beverages. I need to get on there. Okay, I got the juices on there. I didn't show you. That's for the little ones. Adri um, likes these Kool-Aid things. If by chance she has juice, she normally drinks water and milk or chocolate milk. Um, but she does like the Kool-Aid juice thing, so I have those. I do have some Hawaiian punch things for if we're going to like go out of town. I keep those in the car so I can just mix it in the car if they need a drink. Um, but yeah, so that's all on there. And then I'll just like shove the Kool-Aid juice things, um, under here. For when we need those, I just stock a handful in the fridge. I need to see if I need any upstairs. So I can put some in. 
um, like the chocolate milks I keep in the fridge down here. There's juice boxes in the fridge. But yeah, there's the drinks. So this stand's pretty much done. That's our snack food. All cleaned up and organized. Looks so much better than before. Yay! Okay, so my recent Sam's trip, I got more um, chocolate milks because I only saw a couple in the fridge. There was a whole nother uh, case of them. I'm still working on getting this stuff in the wherever it needs to go. I had a whole nother pack over here because over here I have the little Gatorades, regular bottles of water, small bottles of water. And I didn't know I had this either. So now I have one of these upstairs and one of these in the exercise room. Uh, so yeah. I need to put one of the packs of chocolate milk in here. That, that's all I saw is that we just had a couple. That's why I got a whole nother pack. <laughs> um, yeah. So I'm going to put one pack in here and one pack will get stored. I need to have these front and center because these have been here since before I got the other pack. And now, like I said, once this table and this freezer are cleaned off, then I can like put this bo this uh, bouncy castle up on top of them when they want to play and then they have the floor empty. So up here I have applesauce I need to stock upstairs, um, spaghettios I need to stock upstairs, noodles I need to stock upstairs, and then the extra, whatever's extra just kind of goes up on top of this fridge. Same with the muffins, which I just took a box of each upstairs because I bought two of each box, two of each kind, because I haven't been able to find the big boxes at Sam's for like the past month. So when I found them, I got two of each box. They eat them every morning, pretty much. I got a big two pack of ranch, so I have to store one of these ranches down here. I got a couple of these, so I'm just gonna keep one down here because I have one pack upstairs. Like the squeeze yogurts that don't need to be refrigerated, diced peaches, mandarin oranges, things I eat every day. Applesauce pouches, like I said, things I eat every day, mac and cheese, um, or like for lunches. And then these chocolate donuts that I had got for Adri. I got these to try when Jay was here the one day he opened them and tried them. They're the lemonade stand Twinkies. I need to try those. And I also picked these up, red, white, and blue cookies and cream um, chocolate bars to make s'mores. I have just three of these because I have one for each kid. So like stuff like that I keep upstairs so that nobody gets into them down here and then there's enough for everybody. I have this big huge thing of chocolate covered almonds I got at Sam's I need to take upstairs. Fruit Lips I need to go take upstairs because that's cereal. So yeah, that's somewhere. The little ones are sleeping but I have to leave here in like a half hour to get Adri. This is candy from the Easter egg hunt things that we did. Yeah, they got more candy from the Easter thing. Then they did like a trick or treat because we did a couple of like drive through Easter egg hunts. I don't know, this stuff might just disappear. I mean, no, they don't need it, but somebody bought all this. I hate to just throw it away, but I don't know. Maybe I'll have them go through it and just pick out some good things. I don't know, it might just disappear. I'll keep that. Adri loves these. And they love Kit Kat. Oh my god, I don't know. I'll figure it out. <sighs> 